Hello everyone. It's great to see all of you and welcome to our class. I'm John, a smart contract and web city developer, currently working as a template builder in the Ford team. With three years of experience in blockchain development with Solidity, Web3, and Windows.js, I recently completed the Dutch Action template, and now I'm focused on English Action template. While working on the Dutch Action template, I recognized the accessibility and potential of the Ford factory, enabling anyone to engage with it, blockchain, smart contracts, and yet. Our users can easily customize and deploy the template to suit their specific needs and preferences. Speaking of Dutch auction, it is designed for those looking to sell their NFT within a short time frame. This contract implements a Dutch auction for an ERS721 token, starting with a specified price and decreasing over time based on a discount date. So you can find the reference for the Dutch auction contract here. I have customized this solid code to allow users to sell and buy NFT using not only native currency but also stable currencies and other ERS20 tokens. So here is the customized contract code. As you can see, I modified the contract constructor so that the users can set details of the auction, such as the ERS20 token address from which the users want to receive payments. Additionally, I have added some functions such as get remaining time, bit price, get address, and etc. Among these, the buy with normal and buy with native functions are most important as they play a crucial role in executing the main transactions. Once the smart country is completed, we will need to test it on Hadet or Remix. It helps users to build a template without any problems or errors. So, testing on Remix goes through four steps. Create a new solid file, and compile, deploy, and test. After deployment, you can see all did and write functions here and test by just clicking these buttons. Once the test is finished, we can start building the template on the factory. There are three main services such as Marketplace, my applications, and my templates. On the marketplace, we can see all templates the factory has. Firstly, let's see how we can make a template and how we can implement the interaction with the smart contract and the blockchain network. To create a new template, let's go to the My Templates page and click the Add New Template button. Creating the template consisted of five steps. Unload contract, compile, map text, grid template, and publish the marketplace. First step is to unload the contract. After the contract has been unloaded, the contract name and solid compiler version will be shown. On the next page, the contract ABI and bytecode will be displayed to show that the contract is successfully compiled.
The second step is adding tags. On this page, we need to insert tags about all functions and variables of contract. These tags are for the end users to understand what the function is doing. The third step is to create a template. This page is our main workspace to build a template. First of all, the users should select the template type, their application, and web page options. So, application has a single page and can be used to build a simple template. On the other hand, the web page has two pages, including the admin panel that shouldn't be displayed to the end users. Web pages mod can be used for more complex templates. So it has front end template and back end template. Then we can build the template by just dragging and dropping the components from this toolbar. We can add several images and labels and other components according to the characteristics of the template. Also, we can edit and add some custom HTML, CSS, and JavaScript code here so that we can provide a more flexible GUI and various features. The most important is that we can implement the interaction with smart contracts by just using these components. We can see the tags that we have just set on the previous page. If so, let's just see how these components work briefly. By just clicking these buttons, we can send a transaction to the smart contract using MetaMask. And we can send the data from the smart contract here. And this is the final version of the description template, which includes functions such as displaying NF details like the NFT image, NFT country address, and NFT seller. Users can also view the current price in real time and the remaining time for the this option. Additionally, users can click the buy button to purchase the NFT at the current price. As you can see, the factory supports the powerful functions for building DApps. Okay, let's go back. The final step is to publish a template to the marketplace. On this page, we need to add some details of the template, such as icon, fee, description, deployment tutorials, and etc. OK. 
okay then on the marketplace we can find our template that we have just built so here is our template so far we have seen the whole process of how we can build the template from scratch it's not so difficult and complex even those who have no deep knowledge of blockchain smart contracts and dApps can easily build their template okay that's all thank you very much for your attention i hope my guide helps you to develop the template easily thank you